Hey, what's going on, everybody? It's your boy E Double, aka Eric West, and I'm gonna be here doing a reaction video for you guys. Somebody said that I should uh, check this guy out. He was a dude who went to my high school. Uh, he goes by Della Easy, but looking at it, right? Um, not sure how good this is gonna be because you can see right here it says that he had 642 plays, which is pretty great. Um but only seven likes so that's a really really big margin um and only one share on top of that so there's some problems there and there's also no comments that have been left or anything but uh also looking at the cover art right because that type of thing matters as well um looks kind of nice uh you can tell by the font that he's using that this is like a dude who spent basically his whole life in Los Angeles. Uh, that's <laughs> that's what that type of font always means. I don't know why he went ahead and did the Japanese over here. Um, maybe he's just super into anime. I have no idea. I can't read Japanese, so I don't know. I don't know why you would wear white shoes when you're outdoors like that. I mean, you're going to get them kind of fucked up. I probably wouldn't have chose that type of beanie, but I guess I shouldn't be judging people on how they look or some shit, right? So um, hopefully this isn't trash. I like this build up. I like I like the smooth tones. No, no. No, hold up. Alright, it was it was nice. The beat is great. Right, I like the build up that it has. I like the smooth tones that it's giving off. You're expecting something chill. Is this in is this in G minor? No. no that's not right. I can't tell what key this is in, but the light of flicks is nice. Obviously, this isn't his beat. So, props to whoever did make this beat. I think you did a fabulous job. But to come in that way... It wasn't the way that he came in that was the problem for me. It was the fact that it's it's off. That's the problem. Um, whatever he did for the auto-tune is in a entirely different key then the beat is um not even like a matter of pitch it sounds like it kind of sounds like maybe he heard the thing that j cole did on the new album the kill edward type of auto tune and decided to copy that exact same thing but didn't bother trying to get the right pitch get the right note key. Hey, shit, I'm doing me, hey. Um, I'm doing me. Hey, I say I'm doing me. I, I'm gonna skip ahead a bit because I'm really not into this hook. He didn't really take the right approach to it with this. There's not the A's are kind of they're okay. I mean, it, it's a really basic hook if you can call it a hook at this point because I'm not, I'm really trying to like lean away from it now. Uh, fuck. I mean. It would have been nice to have multiple voices doing the A at least, so it seems like there is a crew there with you or something, you know? Um, Because that A should have more impact than it does. I, I, I really don't, don't like the, the way that this fits at all. I think he could have done a, a much better job on that. I can't do it. Did he rhyme blunt with suck? I gotta back that up cuz What? So many ducks. Now if they want it, we could go Wait. ahead and hunt. Just try to rhyme suck with blunt. Maybe he could have went with better word choice there. He didn't really elaborate on when he used to give a fuck. Because I, I can tell by the work quality now that he indeed does not give a fuck. Because this is just kind of sloppy right now. I mean, we'll see where the verse goes. It's still kind of early. I just hope it picks up. I mean, I don't know. 
fucking so many ducks. Now if they want it, we could go ahead and hunt. Okay, I know I only let one line play, but I got put on blunts and started seeing so many ducks. That's kind of that that's beyond cheesy, very cringe, very uncreative. Already within the first within the first bar, it's so evident that there's a lack of skill here. There's oh this sounds like something that maybe a fifth grader could have come up with. I mean, it's it's getting more and more basic as we go on. I, I kind of already don't want to... I'm not even at the one-minute mark yet, and I already don't really want to keep playing this. But, I mean, I was asked to do a breakdown on the whole thing, so I guess I have to. My perspective changed shit when I turned 10. Ain't nobody fucking with me since I back then. Well, actually, they did. Y'all want to hear... The fuck? Okay. This is lacking some major consistency already. Seeing so many ducks, do you want to go ahead and hunt? Duck hunt, like I get the I get the quote unquote bar. I can't call it an actual bar because it's pretty ass. But there's no actual meaning behind that follow up line that connects it, you know? He was 10 years old, no one wanted to fuck with him. Wait a minute, never mind. They. I just. Okay. This is one of those songs where the less you think about it, the more okay it'll be. Like, you just... This song is kind of stupid. Wanna hear a story or wanna hear a sin? Fuck it, let it begin. Middle school, I actually tried, but that shit failed. See, I passed my classes, but I lost myself. See, I couldn't see you. I tried to fit in. They told me be you, but I wouldn't listen. Till I got to high school, I learned my... The beat transition was, was, was fine. Uh, some people... I'll give them credit for that. Some people do tend to fuck up the the beat transition. Um, being able to completely just drop it and then pick start up on the new one. That's uh, one of the easier ways to go about it. Uh, which is fine. It's like whatever gets the job done. I'm just not sure about the rhythm of this. Because, I mean, for those of you like non-musicians, there's mathematics that go behind how you are on beat and how you count how many bars you're on and all this other technical bullshit that I won't sit here and explain to you guys but I, the bar count's going to be kind of off if I sat down to actually work it out I'm pretty sure it would be kind of off but transition wasn't wasn't so bad his tone of rapping better fits the second beat than the first beat so I like that he did move off of it so early um the song is becoming a little more tolerable now but I'm back in this bitch and I feel good All it takes is patience, see I never said I could Now I gotta take it and I wish that you would Try to stop me, not trying to sound cocky But I had a lot of fucking problems like ASAP Rocky And still overcame it looking fresh in the lobby So I'm fucking sorry if you see me doing me No, I'm doing me, darling Hey, shit, I'm doing No, I'm still, even with this switch up I'm, I'm still skipping the chorus I'm still not a fan of it. So far, so far, it's still very, very basic, um, and I can't even really call it. It's not like a before and after type of song, you know. Some uh, that's pretty common in rap, where someone will say, "This was either this was where I was at, and now I'm up here talking about the rags to riches story." Or some rappers will say, this is who I was then, and this is who I, how I discovered myself and how I became who I am now. The maturity, the evolution, the personal growth. We didn't really get any of that here. Um, so this, this whole song is pretty bland so far. I say, I'm, I'm doing, doing me, hey. Ain't no one fucking with me, hey. I worked for this moment, this my inner dopeness, so fuck yeah, I'm doing me. I just got out of a relationship That means I'm single But not ready to mingle But the bells is jingle And for some players That's a foreign lingo This was horrible This was an absolute horrible bar I just got out of a relationship That means I'm single That is There's so many problems with that already I God damn it It, it, it assumes that the audience Is too retarded 
to understand that breaking up with someone means you're single. And from a professional standpoint, it looks awful because... It means saying something so obvious like that, so stupidly obvious like that, you either had no other way to make that line a full ass sentence or you completely lacked the skill to come up with rhymes for relationship, which there's a good amount of ways that you can um, that you can rhyme relationship. And so he decided to go with jing- with single and jingle and mingle because those are the basic as fuck rhymes that even children know. Um, again, the further that we go into this song, the more we see what little skill this person actually possesses. Mingle, but them bells is jingle. And for some players, that's a foreign lingo. But it took some time to feel like this. I ain't gonna lie and say, fuck that bitch. I have no idea what he said there. A foreign lingo. All right, that's pretty good. Um, So this is the first instance that we see a multisyllabic rhyme, which is a a sign of top tier, not lyricism, top tier rhyming ability. But this is the only multisyllabic rhyme he's had in this entire song so far. We're already two thirds of the way through it, even from the aspect of how this song is formatted, it's absolutely sloppy and disgusting. And, you know, like he said in the first verse, you can tell that he just doesn't give a fuck anymore. He's clearly never wrote in a song before, who's had no practice, no experience. He has no technical knowledge of how to format a song, of how to properly write things. It's... I ain't gon' lie and say, fuck that bitch Even though I wanna say, fuck that bitch But the best revenge is success and time I don't wanna say, fuck that bitch But I'ma go ahead and say, fuck that bitch I mean, I can go ahead and tell that it's like I can tell that he's talking about the relationship that he just got out of But this was the absolute wrong place to put it It's kinda like, you're writing an essay and you're like, I just broke up, yada, 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 like all this irrelevant ass shit. Oh my God, I hated my ex. I won't say I hate my ex, but fuck, I hate my ex. He obviously doesn't know, not only in the basic writing format, not even like looking at this at rap, right? But looking at this as, this is probably a person who writes his essays and can't stay on topic but this is also like this is just getting more and more disorganized it's so fucking bad it is so fucking bad i really i wanted to stop like two whole minutes ago but i promised i would break down the damn song so that's then rhyming the the word with itself rhyming fuck that bitch with fuck that bitch Again, it's just proving my point. There's no creativity here. There is no intellect here. It's, it's ass. It's basic. That's all this song is.